Hey, Makeover fans, it's Mike Storm, distinguished cybersecurity engineer with Cisco Systems. We are back for another Cisco IT security makeover. Now, we've been just about everywhere we can go in the United States. We have been coast to coast, from Michigan to Georgia to Napa, California. We even had a chance to go to the Birmingham Zoo and hang out with all the animals. And we got to do our very first IT makeover remote worker edition in Texas, which was absolutely awesome. But as we know, the world has changed. The world has changed so much, in fact, that now everyone must support a work from anywhere culture. And in this case, it's an imperative for most companies to continue business operations no matter what. And of course, cybersecurity is right there with it. So at Cisco IT Security Makeover, we also want to make sure that we can expand. And therefore, we are going to go global. We're going to go across the pond to Madrid, Spain, and talk to an organization called MediaPro. We're going to talk to Roberto. Now, Roberto is the man at MediaPro. He understands what it takes to secure and operate his environment in the changing world and make sure that all of his customers, employees, and assets are kept secure. Something that we are absolutely proud to help with as part of the Cisco IT security makeover. Roberto, how are you doing today? Fine, thanks, Mike. So tell the audience, um, what do you do at MediaPro? And tell us a little bit about what MediaPro does. Well, I'm a telecom and security engineering global director, and I'm responsible for the design and projects of MediaPro telecommunications and security systems. MediaPro is a leading group in the European audiovisual sector. It's a leader in content integration, production, and audiovisual distribution. We've got 60 offices across 30, 36 countries. Wow, that sounds like a big job. Could you give the audience a little idea of some of the challenges in a hybrid environment such as yours? MediaPro is a company with almost 7,000 people we have to provide in a very short time solutions for work environments that never existed remotely before. I can imagine that with the type of data that you're protecting, privacy has got to be a very high priority. Could you explain a little bit as to why privacy is so important and, and really what you're doing uh, to accomplish uh, whatever is necessary to keep that data safe? We are protecting any kind of corporate users' data, um, high confidential information such as uh, rights contracts, technical broadcasting data, and customers' information and video content. What does the IT department look like, and, and how, how large is your security team that leverages these solutions? We are a high-level technical team. We are very motivated and excited about working with the best uh, state-of-the-art technology. What was life like before those security solutions, previous experiences? Lack of integration uh, has uh, always been a problem. If you don't have a core security tool which integrates completely your whole security systems, then your visibility, control, or automation are going to be compromised. So the key is to find a solution that provides the exact number of what really matters. Today, with Cisco SecureX, we have solved lack integration problems and balance between number and severity of alerts. What are some of the, the recent security uh, solutions that you've adopted from Cisco that you're leveraging with SecureX? Our goal was trying to keep every endpoint safe and reject access to any endpoint not safe for our network. We also did a, a massive deployment of Cisco AnyConnect to extend ICE network access control with uh, Cisco Posture solution, and also including umbrella DNS advantage protection to any external endpoint. Finally, we adopted Cisco SecureX, which is our core security tool and integrates all our Cisco security systems. That's great. And how, is your, how has your team been adjusting to using SecureX as the primary console for threat operations? Adaptation has been easy and effective. Once all the systems have been integrated under SecureX, well, they have uh, control, visibility, forensic analysis of all the systems that they already managed before, but under a single platform. Um, that's pretty cool for them. 
That's great. Yeah, it's many, many times uh, SecureX is kind of viewed as only for really small companies and you're proof that, uh, that large companies take advantage of this type of technology as well. Everybody needs integration. Everyone needs better operations. That seems to be a common theme. So really appreciate hearing that. As part of the makeover, you're also taking advantage of uh, one of our newest workflows, which is for phishing. Can you uh, tell us how that's working out for you? Phishing is one of the biggest challenges today. So in a matter of a uh, couple of minutes, we have blocked the thread. We have a record of this new thread, and our SOC team is under alert. We never had anything like this before, so today we can say that we have saved a lot of time in discovering a phishing attack, recovering an account, tracing malicious actions. Uh, probably we we're talking about days. How do you feel right now about your ability to protect user privacy and your data, your assets going into the future using Cisco solutions? Keeping up to date is essential to security systems and with this huge amount of new threats, you need visibility, rapid intelligence, and faster response. At this larger scale, um, you can only keep all your security systems up to date with a company like Cisco. We are just so thrilled to hear the success story about your use of integrated security solutions and specifically SecureX uh, to optimize your operational environment, uh, to make it easier for you to detect threats and, and, and really respond to threats. We so thank you for being part of the IT security makeover and it's been great to talk with you today. Thanks, Roberto. Thank you very much, it has been a pleasure. Now, Roberto is doing it right. Not only does he have a single console for a global view of all of his information, but he can also manage all of his threat information and run investigations behind the scenes. Because the name of the game at Media Pro, certainly the show must go on. When we think about hybrid work, it's critically important that we're able to support our remote resources and be able to see and manage them as they may exist anywhere. This work from anywhere culture, as you could see, I also have some work I have to do myself. So this is Mike Storm signing off. IT security makeover, protecting businesses globally, one customer at a time.